Pakistan is an Islamic country and it has a lot of mosques, but there are some really interesting and unique mosques here. So here's a list of my top 10 unique mosques in Pakistan. As a Muslim country, Pakistan has a lot of mosques and there are some really interesting and unique ones in there. Now, what I found really interesting about Pakistan is that most of these mosques were actually conceived and built as mosques rather than, you know, taken over by some other places of worship from some other religion. Here are my top 10 unique mosques in Pakistan. But before you go, I do want to tell you if you're visiting any of these mosques, I would recommend that you, if you're a woman, you need to cover your head and uh, you wear some loose baggy clothes. And if you're a man, make sure your legs, your shoulders, your arms are covered. It is just a sign of respect for any place of worship. Let's go check those out. This is Chakchen Mosque. It's made in Tibetan style and it's probably the only mosque in Pakistan that's entirely made of wood. I mean, the style is quite Buddhist, but when people converted to Islam, they wanted to pay homage to their um, new religion using the old traditional methods. And they built this entirely out of wood. It's beautiful. I've never seen a mosque like this before. And I don't think I ever will because this is very unique. It's very colorful and it's very, very unique. I am totally in love with this place. To be honest, I really didn't want to come to Khaplu. But when I saw the photos of this place and this arena palace, the Khaplu Palace, I had to change my mind and I just came. It was just too good to ignore. Ambarik Mosque is one of the oldest mosques in the region and it's entirely made of wood. It is really beautifully decorated but the most important thing is the scenery around it. The majestic mountains at the back and the blossoms around make it absolutely special. I'm sitting in Faisal Mosque. It's the fifth largest mosque in the world and the largest mosque in South Asia. It is quite different, not only in architecture and style, but also how people treat mosques in the country. Whereas the rest of the mosques are treated with, you know, a lot of holiness and there's strict rules. This is treated more as a social space, as, you know, a place where people come in the evenings to enjoy themselves. And it's quite nice and spacious. So it's a great spot for people watching as well. I'm loving it. Mahabad Khan Mosque is a real gem in Peshawar. It was made during the Mughal era and is named after the governor of the region. The central hall and the courtyard both are beautifully decorated but if you go into the central hall you will be amazed by the level of detail in the work the amount of color the patterns used it is really exquisite and all the work is really really detailed
Sunari Masjid or Golden Mosque is located in Peshawar as well. And while this might not be the oldest mosque, it is definitely a real beauty. While Mahabad Khan Mosque is very colorful, Suneri Mosque is completely different. It's the only two colors that are prominent, tea pink and white, and that make it a different sort of elegant and beautiful. Shahi Mosque in Lahore is another architectural masterpiece from Mughals. This mosque is not only a symbol of Lahore but also a symbol of Pakistan. Its interior is quite simple and quite different, but at the same time, it's intricate enough to dazzle you. You have not visited Pakistan if you've not seen a beautiful sunset sitting in the courtyard of Bachai Mosque. Azir Khan Mosque is located not far from Bachai Mosque, but it is a completely different mosque altogether. It is full of color, it is so full of life, it is really beautifully created inside and out from its minarets to its dome to its interior. Every single inch is covered in color, beautiful patterns. Bong Masjid is another architectural and design masterpiece that marries that beautiful Mughal architecture with the Persian style and includes a lot of mirror work. A big chunk of the decoration of this mosque is made of solid pure gold. Like Faisal Mosque, Duba Mosque is also a recent addition to the list of mosques in Pakistan and it has the record for being the largest domed mosque in the entire world. There are no pillars or support and the only thing that covers the entire mosque is a dome surrounded by low walls.
The Shahi Mosque or the Royal Mosque of Chitral is another really interesting and unique place in Pakistani mosques. The really interesting thing about this mosque is that it is a very flexible building because of a lot of earthquakes that hit this area. They covered the walls and added sheep hair into the construction so that they absorb some of the impact of the earthquakes. I hope you enjoyed exploring these beautiful unique mosques in Pakistan with me and I will see you guys in the next video. If you like this, please do like, subscribe, share and comment and let me know what you think and if there's any place that I've missed and I should visit next time. Until the next video, you guys have a beautiful blessed day ahead.